Good morning and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. I'm Mark and today I'm going to take you for a walk around our 2007 Holden Commodore Crewman Ute. We'll start off at the front of the car and a uh, few things just to uh, point out. A few minor little touch-ups just on the uh, front lip of our bonnet. A couple of little touch-ups on the front bumper bar as well. Driving lights fitted in the, in the bottom of the rear front bar and does have aftermarket alloys as well. Really good looking alloy wheel too. Um, does have the colour coded calipers at the front as well and tyres are probably 90% tread. Um, being the crewman you'd obviously four door um, and the way it presents, apart from a minor little, well it's not a scratch, it's just dirt. A um, couple of little touch ups just on the uh, hard lid there as well. Um, genuine hard lid too. Uh, overall, the presentation of the car is, uh, yeah, no, really good. Um, as we get around to the rear of the car, a few touch-ups just on the uh, edge of our hard lid there as well. Uh, once again, they're just minor cosmetic things. Is fitted with a uh, tow bar, uh, gives us the ability to tow 2.1 tonne. Um, and... Uh, Certainly impressive for a 2007 model. Um, the way this car presents is really good. Minor little scuff on the uh, left-hand rear alloy wheel, uh, but the overall presentation of the exterior is uh, is is quite good. Uh, yeah, so overall, I'm uh, I'm quite happy with the appearance of this particular vehicle. Back around at the front of the car now, just before we have a chat about the drive line, just another uh, minor thing just to touch on, uh, a bit of a touch up there. Uh, obviously some bird droppings at some stage, but we've just touched it up cosmetically. Powered by a uh, V6, 3.6 uh, litre V6. Will give us 172 kilowatts of power and 320 newton metres of torque. Uh, we'll still deliver 12.7 litres combined per 100 k's. So you will get over 500 k's out of a tank of fuel. So as I mentioned earlier, back at the rear of the car now, factory hard lid lockable as well. Obviously we have the keys to lock it down. Just a couple of gas struts lift it right up out of our way. Um, is fitted with the factory, uh, factory liner. Um, our tow bar tongue just to our right hand side there. And actually, for its age, the condition of the tub itself is in really good order. So, uh, no, it's good. So inside the uh, Commodore Ute now, the crewman, and uh, we'll just run through some of the features, pay attention to the quality of the interior as well. Um, we do have auto headlights, uh, so they will turn themselves on as darkness approaches. On our driver's armrest, we've got our uh, power, power mirror switch. Um, this car is fitted with Bluetooth also, so a little microphone up on our right hand side there. Uh, we've got a height and reach adjustable steering wheel, so set ourselves up where we're nice and comfortable, lock it into position and away we go. On the left hand side here, we've got our mode button, just feeds us all the information on our screen, uh, distance to empty, fuel consumption and so on. Um, 150, 1000 k's, so good k's for its age this car. Moving into the centre console section, our heating and cooling controls here. Um, and then directly below that, we've got an aftermarket multifunction head unit. So it does compromise satellite navigation, AM, FM, stereo, CD player. Um, and even though it's an aftermarket system, it is still powered up to our, our steering wheel controls. Uh, we'll just send that phone call to the keeper. Four speed automatic transmission. So fairly straightforward in the Holden. We've got a power button there as well, power or economy. Uh, our electric window switches, handbrake to our right hand side, cup holders there as well, and, and good storage compartment also. Our remote control to our multifunction unit as well. Other thing to pay attention to, just have a look around the interior. Um, the quality of the, the way the seats and, and floor floors, the door trims, factory car mats as well. Um, the overall presentation's really good. And a lot of that comes down to the way it's been maintained. Our service history is very good as well. Most of our services are stamped in our books pretty much all the way through. 
a little bit intermittent at some stages, but uh, overall service history is quite good. We've just carried out an intermediate service as well. So in summary, a uh, fairly impressive example of a 2007 uh, VZ Crewman Ute. Good case for its age. Is fitted with uh, factory hard lid. Does have the tow pack as well. Good service history. Just uh, uh, an outstanding quality example of a 2007 Ute. Um, give us a call on 9907 for any further assistance.